Hello, I'm Kim Sauer at Productronica 2017. I'm joined by Michael Kamara from the Comic Group and Paul Smith, also Comic Group. And we'll, we'll first turn to you, Michael. Comic Group as a whole, there's a lot of activities going on. There's a lot of companies beneath that. Can you just give us a very brief overview in that structure and the direction you're taking it? Yeah, Comet Group is a, is a Swiss-based company, the headquarters in Switzerland, and we have 13 or 14 different locations worldwide. Um, we have three main technologies. This is RF power, this is X-ray, and this is EV. And this is how we set up the group based on these three main technologies. And business-wise, we are divided into uh, four divisions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But what we re want to more represent, and uh, here I'm coming to Lab One, is the three technologies uh, combined together on one roof that people to attract people, maybe for RF power, but then they see X-ray, oh, EV, what's EV? Yeah. And attract the, the yeah. guys to for our other technologies. And so far, our experience is very good in a very short time because almost all customers or new guys are at least attracted by one other technology of the group. I was going to say it's interesting because if you look around even here at the show, there's a lot of company yeah. changing their, their, their strategies, their marketing messages, and it's becoming all about connectivity, all about mm -hmm. communication, and not just communication within a, 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 like a single company structure, departmental, but communication between other uh, well, cross functionalities, other uh, customers, etc. So that's very much like a little bit industry 4.0 style. Absolutely. How how is that driven? Is it the customers driving that, or is it the companies offering that to customers? It's a mix. It's we are we are customer driven. Yeah. Uh, especially in. PCT, the semi-industry, I mean, you know that uh, everything is speed, fast, change, uh, short development times, but also the other industries have, have, have uh, speed up their, their drive uh, to, for new products, new technologies. And um, yes, and then IoT and Industry 4.0, uh, all is coming together now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Then now we had to find out how can we answer to that? Now what's, what's our response? Not to, to get out of this reactive mode. Huh? Yeah, sure. Be proactive and, and a leading company in that. Yeah. And, and I think speed and agility, I guess, is, what, is exactly what you need in all this. Everybody yeah. about that, but uh, we really try to, yeah. to implement it. To yeah. it. This is very important. And you mentioned information exchange. And so there's another element, a very important element, is collaboration. I mean, you have to collaborate today. Without collaboration, nothing will yeah. further go on yeah. with uh, new technologies or products or IoT or whatever yeah. else. Without collaboration, no success. Yeah. Hence the birth of what you call Lab One. Lab One, yeah. yes. Um, so, Paul, tell me about Lab One because it, you, you've just launched it, you just had the opening very recently. So. Again, just give us a little bit of a flavor of what Lab, is, uh, Lab One is all about and, and how that launch went. So the launch went really well. Yeah. And, um, we had great attendance from multiple industries, from the yeah, SMT, EMS, um, CEOs from many different industries came, they joined us, um, and they experienced a, a new level of collaboration that they hadn't seen before. And uh, they've sent, since then, they've sent their engineering teams in, um, and the engineers come in with one idea of what they want to do with with Comet or X Exlon, mm -hmm. which is our X-ray systems or E-beam. Mm -hmm. And when they see the other technology, they immediately start coming up with new applications to mm -hmm. try again, mm -hmm. and they come back a second time. So our customers come in; they visit many times now mm -hmm. to the lab, mm -hmm. um, and the engagement is really collaborative. And this is what we tried to do. And we we want to continue with that. Mm. So, uh, what's the next step? Technology. The next step is yeah. Paul started the the show there, huh? yeah. so he is now <laughs> creating traffic. In, in, in you got lab. the ball rolling. Yeah, yeah. your Absolutely. responsibility to take it further. And we want to keep it rolling. Yeah, keep it rolling. Yeah. Yes. 
take the momentum and yeah. keep it. And yes, Lab One is not only a, a test center or, yeah. or for fun. We also want to create new business out of Yeah, that. absolutely. So yeah, that's okay. a business model. Yeah. Kind of. So Lab One, the current Lab One is located in the United States. Are there plans for further Lab Ones around the world? I There's, would say yes. Yeah. There's ideas for it. Yeah. yeah. And uh, you know, we have a uh, we take a successful launch. We'll continue. And uh, if necessary, we'll make more lab ones. Yeah. And uh, I think it, it's it's actually a fun experience, not only for us as a company to come together, yeah. where we were once three, four divisions who believed that we had nothing in common. We now find out that our customers help us yeah. work together better. And, Excellent. Uh, this is a good company coming together, as well as a, a good set of technologies going out to customers to help solve their problems. And I think we'll go to different places around the world with it. Yeah, excellent. Okay, well, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. And I uh, wish you great success here at Prototronica in cold Munich. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Good thank luck. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you.